Agential phenomena for today is on this topic. The way we raise our children in this 21st century. Every man, uh, every woman wants to copy the Western way or style. These days, parents no longer talk to their children. <laughs> They don't worry their children. They don't even scold their children, no matter what the child does. They laugh over it. You hear things like, Junior, why do you do this? Hey, baby, why do you do that? Don't do it again. Do you know that mommy will be angry with you? Do you want mommy to be angry with you? In Africa. A child will destroy a property worth hundreds of thousands. And the mom will say, Ah, why do this now? Oh my God. And that is all. The man comes back. He's told what has happened. He brings another money. The wife buys another one and replaces the one the child destroys. Now, ask yourself this question. What are you raising for the society? Is this the way it should be? Or is that the best way you can deal with it? See, we must remember that we are Africans. And we have our own culture of life, our own way of life. We cannot abandon our way i copy the way of the Western mind. It's wrong. We cannot do that. We cannot do that. To do that means we are actually losing our heritage. We must raise our children in a way that they will become better human beings for the betterment of our society. For that of our own selves and mankind at large. Remember that whatever you do today or whatever train you give to a child is what the child grows with. Take a look at what is happening. In every 10 boys, 6 or 7 of them are courtists. In every 10 girls, at least 5, 6, 7. I need to hook up. That is what they call legal prostitution. That is if there is anything like legal prostitution. I always bring about all this. Why? Because of the style of raising the children. They no longer see value to morality. See, we have we don't have much to say, but. The only thing we can say is that whatever you do, know that you will live with the consequences of it. Even when you die, it is your bloodline. And your bloodline is your bloodline. The price is always extreme. So please, African parents, come back to our African way. Come back to African style. Let's raise our children the way they should be. Give them the best in life. Show them love, but do not destroy them with stupid love. What you call love is not love. It's confusion. Love is when you scold the child, correct the child, even punish a child, and at still the same time. Pamper that child and let the child understand why you did whatever you did to him or her. So that that child will know that there is a consequence for everything. For every action, there is what causes an effect. So thank you. Please. Let's do the right thing. And let our society.